It's no secret that the Las Vegas Raiders are looking for answers. They're looking for answers along that offensive line. And you got to be honest with you, if we're being honest, it's probably the weakest part of the, you know, the entire team. Let's be real. You've got Colton Miller at left tackle, who's a stud. Guys should just honestly be there for the next 10 years. Leave him. He's fine. Other than that, you've got some issues. Uh, if we're being honest, obviously, you know, I, I liked uh, what I saw from a guy uh, you know, like Alex Leatherwood down the line. Now, it was rough to start out with, but watch the tape. I know what I'm, I'm going to get some hate for this, but I'm going to stand out on a ledge for my man Alex Leatherwood because A, yes, it was rough. It was absolutely rough to start it up, but I really saw a player uh, towards the end there that is A, coachable, he is willing to learn, he's intelligent, and he's got a lot of the things you want to see. I saw some good things out of Alex Leatherwood at the end of the year, uh, and I felt like, you know, I think it's a little too soon to be able to, you know, uh, start giving a guy a hard time because I do think there's still a lot of good things that will come from a guy like Alex Leatherwood. Now, what does the rest of this mean when we talk about the rest of this uh, this, this particular offensive line for the Raiders? I think one player to keep an eye on is Thayer Munford. That's right, the former Ohio State Buckeye, who I think is going to make some noise down the line. Now, again, I think, what, is it, what does it come down to? That's the ultimate question you always have to ask yourself. I think it comes down to how fast is he going to get on the field? How fast is it going to be where he has a chance to actually show this coaching staff what he can do? I think it'll be quicker than a lot of people think. I think he's going to get a chance to start at right tackle. I think he's going to get a chance to be looked at a right guard. And I said it from the beginning. I feel like the Raiders need to be in a position where they try everybody, everybody out along that offensive line. I don't care. Literally everybody other than Colton Miller should be shuffled around. I mean, it's nothing personal. I think Dylan Parham needs to have a shot, but I think honestly a guy Guy like Thayer Munford needs to be playing every single offensive line snap or at least uh, playing every position that that offense has because at the end of the day I think the Raiders are in a position where this is it this is the only thing we're hinging our bets on this is the only thing we're wondering about if it can take the next step if this offensive line can hold together uh, and, and do some good things I absolutely think it can I think you know there's a lot of good things uh, for this uh, particular offense excuse me that I think there's a lot of good things that could happen for it now do I think that it's perfect no I think again I think that at the end of the day uh, the, the, the biggest thing we're worried about is the offensive line so what does that mean when we look at uh, all these different spots along the offensive line we look at at okay cold miller we mentioned it starting a left tackle fine denzel good i think if he's fully back uh, i'm excited about it uh, as we mentioned in that article we touched on uh i believe who was it was it sports not i can't remember but anyway go look back at that one because i gave a lot of updates about raiders camps and everything kind of who's kind of shining who's not uh and i believe from my recollection denzel good's taking a little bit longer to take uh, and get back from that acl but that's fine they, i think they should try out guys in the meantime you got dylan parham uh, and andre james at those center spots Andre james the incumbent starter I really feel like Dalen Parham should start at least at guard or center. I don't care. Get this man on the field. Then you got Jermaine Illuminar and Alex Leatherwood kind of uh, putting this all back together. You got John Simpson and also as well as Bamadisi Olasini. Uh, Bamadil Olasini. I just call him Bam. Everybody calls him Bam because he's a stud. So uh, honestly, Bamadili, if, if Alex Leatherwood isn't figuring out if maybe putting him back at guard is the answer, then putting Bam at right tackle. I love that. But at the end of the day, they, the Raiders need to see what they have in a guy like Thayer Munford because I feel like top to bottom, he is going to be a guy that can be on the inside and the outside, uh, and I think he can do a lot of damage for the Raiders. I mean, what's what's the harm? What is the absolute harm in trying these guys out at, at spots? You know, I mean, you never know. Maybe you guys, he's not necessarily a starter at left tackle in the NFL, but at left guard, maybe he's a future Hall of Famer. Who knows? That's why you have camp. That's why you have uh, all these different things. You, you have all these guys in there. Munford, I believe, was a, was a player that was getting some looks and some love at a lot of other spots. So he definitely needs to be a player uh, that needs to get all of the opportunities. And I think he could surprise for the Las Vegas Raiders. I think you just got to try him out. And again, if it comes down to he just doesn't play well, okay, fine. But, you know, you tried it. You you looked at every possible way to improve this offensive line with the current talent on, on the, that is on the roster. At the end of the day, I think, though, that Thayer Munford could be a surprise starter, even a surprise player for the Las Vegas Raiders offensive line. But let us know what you guys think. Make sure you guys like and subscribe down below. Leave a like and a comment. It helps people find the show. We greatly appreciate all the support that we've gotten and continue to get. You guys are all truthfully awesome. We love every single one of you. Down in the description below, you'll find all of our social media platforms so give us a like and a follow there also remember to give us a listen and sub on itunes and finally if you have anything else you'd like to cover send us an email at the sportsbp at yahoo.com or put it in the comment section down below and we would love to cover it but let's know what you guys think about there munford who could be a surprise player and starter for the las vegas raiders offensive line